annual poker alley. We have this every year, and uh, it it all started with uh, our our late buddy there, Linda Flat, and uh, she had passed away. Well, how many years now? For this uh, poker alley, and uh, they it did it in memory of her. And uh, Alice Hansen recently passed away. And now they renamed it to Alice Hansen Memorial from uh, from her recent passing. And she she was a teacher here in Pine House, right? And uh, she was an inspiration to other people. We've got so many relatives in the neighboring, yeah, like Laurence, Buffalo, even as far as Laloche, and and uh, I heard there are some from uh, uh, Black Lake that came down just to uh, over day. Some had to come and stay overnight just to because there's quite it's quite a distance from here, and and we've got relatives all over, and that it's also bringing in, in the families together too, re, re, uh, a reunion, just like a reunion also. So it's really beneficial and it's, it's our pride and joy. money back to the community so we can help the youth and other things, uh, recreational stuff, and to bring the people together from all over the north uh, to see old friends, feed them, have some good uh, food and stuff like that. You know, it was started 18 years ago to fundraise for kids in a community to have an arena. We started that process way back when we were one of the last communities in the north that was uh, missing an arena. And we, you know, to this day we still have a, a, a very, very young population and we need to keep our kids uh, busy doing something else that's positive and, you know, the dream was uh, back in the day that you know let's fundraise maybe the government will look at us one day that when, when we have a few bucks and it's been going to 18 years we have an arena now you know lucky we had a a business arm that you know supported us to to make it happen but now uh, the, the other thing is uh, to keep the lights on so we're fundraising every year and we you know this uh, fundraiser uh, gives us an opportunity to pay for the whole year uh, power bill and because we have uh, artificial ice and, and it's really uh, beneficial to, to our community, especially keeping kids busy. I've been contemplating on even trying to get myself a snow machine to be more involved and be out there myself. So, uh, yeah. You know, events like this, we you know we work hard as a whole community to, to bring us together. And uh, you know, as a community, we work together. And when we work together, we can see, we we, we can easily measure the the outcome. And you know, we we bring so much good to the community. And you know, of course, you know, we're doing it for our youth. And the youth see us. You know, when we work together, we get really good results. And so this, you know, it, it, it's all benef it benefits the whole community once we, once we work together. We have good practices, in, you know, doing these poker rallies for 18 years. And, uh, you know, we're going on to our eighth year on the elders gathering. And it's learning to, you know, to stay positive and work together that, you know, bring a lot of good to, to the community in Pine House. It is a really awesome cause, and, and, and like I said, for me, what I see is the unity and the people coming together of uh, yeah, different, uh, different, national, different nations. Uh, yeah. Events like this, it brings people from all over, and they, they, they do connect with everybody, right? And, uh, and everybody just has a lot of fun, you know? Like, I, don't know I don't know how to explain it. It's just, it's just an awesome year, yeah, like every year, every spring. This, this, this is what. <laughs> this is. I, I just want to invite whoever uh, 
she's just uh, come and come and join uh, Pine House is such a well welcoming community uh, uh, everybody that uh, you can ask about Pine House and it's a great community and this is just one aspect and one event that we put up